Following breaking news this morning, two women are dead after police say their car lost control during a chase. Gabrielle Mays is joining us live right now from 23rd and Hopkins on Milwaukee's north side with how this entire thing started. Yeah, so Milwaukee police say that it started with the police chase and it ended with what you see right here behind me. You can see uh, this white Jeep. It's an SUV. Uh, it ended up crashing uh, into an empty building. Um, the crash really mangled, if you can see that, the front end of that vehicle, all of the doors uh, now off of it. But there's bricks still scattered uh, on the ground as well as pieces of metal, uh, twisted metal that's still uh, there in the road. Uh, there was also, if you take a look at this video that we got from a Fox 6 photographer earlier this morning, uh, the street sign for 23rd is just on the uh, in the middle of the ground. Uh, that really just gives you the impact of this particular crash. Um, at one point, uh, Milwaukee Fire Department is using heavy equipment to cut the doors off the Jeep and remove the two people inside. And that's why uh, when, you, when I was talking about this earlier, you can see those car, uh, the doors off of this vehicle. Uh, Milwaukee police tell us just before one this morning, the white Jeep didn't stop as officers followed the vehicle. Police say the SUV lost control and then crashed into an abandoned or empty building. The two women inside were a 20-year-old Milwaukee woman and a 28-year-old Greendale woman. Now we now know both of those women have died. Uh, Milwaukee police say nobody else was hurt in this particular incident. And as we continue to learn more this morning, we'll bring it to you here live, reporting live in Milwaukee. Gabrielle Mays, Fox 6 News. Gabrielle, thank you.